Michelle from Early Literacy Matters. We've been talking about bugs this whole week, reading lots of great stories, and we talked about going on a bug hunt, hunting for bugs either outside in the wild, looking for grasshoppers or ladybugs. It's raining here today, so going outside is not a great idea. And I wanted to show how you might be able to do this inside as well. Now, I don't have any young ones at home, so Lily is gonna be our guinea pig today. She's gonna walk me through and we're gonna go hunting for bugs. Now, I have some stuffed bugs, but I also wanted to show you, if you don't have stuffed animal bugs, you might print some things, or if you're a really good artist, maybe you wanna draw a ladybug or a grasshopper or a butterfly. I just printed this off um, from the internet and we can hide these around the house in a place that your toddler might be able to reach them and they can see them easily. It makes for a fun kind of scavenger hunt. So we're gonna go hunting. Lily, are you ready? Come on, let's go, let's go find a butterfly. Come on, let's go. What do you see? What is this? What is that? I see a butterfly. Yes, look at that. Look at its green head and its orange wings. And look at those legs, and I even see an antenna. So let's count. We've got orange wings. One, two, three, four. And look at those long legs down there. You wanna count those with me? I know you can't use your words, but one, two, three, four, five, six. The butterfly has six legs. How very cool. And two eyes. Can you see the eyes? One, two. Awesome. So we just talked about the different colors. We were able to count. We were able to talk about the bug and identify its features just by this little stuffed animal. So let's go on another hunt. You ready? Let's keep going. Come on, let's find something else. You ready? Come on, what do you see? What do you see? What is that? Oh my goodness. Lily, sit down please. Thank you. It's a ladybug. Yeah, what color is it? What colors do you see? Red and black. I see two eyes. I see one, two, three, four, five, six legs. That's funny. It has the same number of legs as the butterfly. And this is interesting. Look at all those spots. Very cool, huh? So again, lots of language in this activity, lots of opportunity to walk around the house and have an experience with your child, developing language, learning about bugs, and just having a fun time playing hide and go seek. So I hope you enjoyed this activity. Take care and, and join me again. Uh, take a look at the activity page to find some other activities you might choose to do. Thanks so much, bye-bye.